episode, The Endangered Species. I just realized I'm not in the screen, so now I'm in here. So is it starting or over? This is really deceptive because I took this video and it was kind of light out. I don't know why the video looks so dark. I mean, some of these are lighter than others. Like, you know, that may be 
15 minutes out there, not even. The drones can't stay up that long. They can only stay up as long as the battery can last. So they're still going pretty good, pretty heavy out there. This is Tucson, it's just regular people. This isn't any kind of city thing at all, it's just above people's houses. Above, like, open lots probably, and in the street, like where two streets come together, an intersection, I guess they call that, in some places. People will light off firecrackers in the middle of the intersection, and then that way, they don't care about getting anything on fire. Also, there's like parks and things where people will go. There's a whole bunch of these, the biggest ones of these are going right off right next to a big fire department. <laughs> So obviously the fire department don't care. All these giant ones like this are right over next to a giant or next to a fire department. It's not a giant fire department, but it's in a field next to a fire department. So they must not give a shit. Or they can't do nothing about it. But those aren't I mean somebody might be sponsoring them or something, but these aren't like golf courses or anything. These are just regular people. And I'm whipping this thing around like a spaz, but there's all kinds of little ones going off on the ground. These giant ones are huge. Like I would consider them golf course level or like amusement park level. Like they cost some money. Those are like hundreds of bucks. Like each one of them big ones is a hundred bucks or way more than hundred bucks. Oh, I missed it. Did I go down? Did I go down? Did I go down? This is the video where somebody's screwing around in the front there. And they shoot. Come on, they didn't go down anymore. Oh, they're shooting some kind of fountain out right there in the bottom. They didn't go down anymore. I can't see out of my drone. So that's the problem. Oh, look at that one. Can you hear the ones going off in real life out there? There's still really big ones going off in real life. Because now it's dark. It wasn't even dark when it's going on. This, I turn the camera off and turn it back on up there, just just in case kind of thing. Oh, there it is. Did I get it? Oh, I didn't get it. See, I don't know how far down it'll go. This is right about the top of the, uh, right around the, not the top of, but the wires on a, on a telephone pole. That's about how high this is. So it's about the same as if I, Go up by the roof and hold it and stick up in the air with a camera on it. It's not really all that high, but it gets up over the trees and the bushes and stuff around. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that whistle. Hopefully, they've got more and more methods to deal and cope and moderate it so it doesn't become a, what do they call that? You know, like a virus, literally, but like, you know, go through the whole place, hopefully they can stop it where it's at. Now, if I was in, I'm only in one part of town, this one's pretty big. Oh, that was a good one. Pretty sure this is there's a tree right in the middle of this and i wasn't sure if i was going to see these because there's this tree and i don't even think you can tell there's a tree in the middle i think this is what i'm looking at almost positive there's a tree right in the middle of everything here yeah look when that car keeps going there's a tree right there it's just that uh the angle and everything this thing gets a great view of everything see that ones those going off that's just somebody sitting in a street somewhere that's just these aren't like anywhere special. These are just out and people do them in front of their house, I think. Man, that's cool. So if anybody wants to give you any crap and be like, blah, blah, blah. Nobody cares about the country. Blah, blah, blah. Nobody cares about patriotism. Blah, blah, blah. This is just Tucson. This is just regular old Tucson. We're not this or that or nothing. We're just regular old Tucson. There's tons of people blowing off firecrackers right now. Tons of them. I've lived here for a long time, and it's, I mean, this ain't the most that's ever happened, but this is a lot. There ain't no way this is a light year. I mean, this ain't a heavy year. This is just kind of a good year. I could probably get just as good a video if I went on top of my roof and put, like, my, like, made a big tripod 
and then stuck a camera up there with some kind of pipe on a swivel and then maybe even like a, some kind of a motor or something to kind of like can it. But anyway, I think I could just stick a camera, like a cell phone, and a pipe. And I think I could have got better video because this looks about like that. Because now I'm looking way up and you can't even, like if there was giant firecrackers, it would look great. But something's happening in that yard over there and you can't tell. Echo. Oh, look, that's when we kind of medium. But that's just out of somebody's backyard. So I like to think a lot of these are people going, hey, you want to get some fireworks and then show them, shoot them off in front of the kids? Yeah. Because I can't imagine too many single couples are like, well, oh, you know what, let's do, let's get a bunch of firecrackers. So I'm guessing a whole bunch of these, or most of these fireworks you see going off, is a whole bunch of little smiles and grins and giggles and whatever. But, but the kids are like, we did it off our own firecrackers. We didn't need to have the government run off no firecrackers. My mom and dad did. So I don't even live on a hill. I just kind of live on a flat part. I just put this drone up about the... Whoa, did you hear that one? That was a pretty big one. There's some... I appreciate sure those cartel members that live down the street from here. And yeah, they got all kinds of money to blow on firecrackers. So uh, this is just regular part two sound. I'm about up as high as the wires on the telephone lines. I guess there are electric lights out here. But you know, whatever a telephone pole height is, I'm not even all the way to the top of it. I'm just about, like I said, probably about as high as if I stuck a pole on top of my house. Or if I had a second floor house, I'd even be taller, I think. So this is just uh, Tucson kind of creeps up into the mountains and stuff so I kind of you know, kind of see a good air. It's like I'm looking up a ramp towards most of Tucson. And then this will be the last one. I try not to spin it all around like a spaz. But it was really windy. It kept moving around up there. I'm actually pretty impressed that the camera's doing this good after wrecking it so many times. Plus, I was able to take it off no problem and land it pretty good. I didn't wreck it or nothing out there today. I almost wrecked it once, but I didn't wreck it at all. This could be anywhere. This is kind of boring. I don't like this version. I think that's that same. I'm looking the same way. It's just that I'm looking straight up instead of sideways. But these fireworks look like they're coming out of black because there's that tree behind there. I don't know what's going on behind that tree, but somebody lives over there that blows off a lot of fireworks, that's for sure. Oh, look at that one. Nice. And then that's where I remember this, where I probed the camera the wrong way. I can see it. And look, I didn't even see from where my angle, but there's a whole fountain of them happening in the background. I really, really, really wanted to take the camera, the drone, and go to the right, like way out in front of my house and get around that tree. But I didn't really want to start putting the drone in front of other people's houses or on top of other people's houses. And then I think this is just coming back down. Yeah. So I just take a flashlight and let it land in front of me with the flashlight shining away. It doesn't look like nothing to the drone, I guess. This will be the first one again for everybody that missed it. Oh yeah, they're already going off before I even get the thing up in the air. So now I'm up in the air. There's those electric lines or whatever. And then... Yeah, that's worked out pretty good. It's a little cruddy because it's not that great of a camera, I guess. Or maybe I have the resolution for it. 